Yo, what is going on guys, it's Cryptic TMG and I'm back with a brand new video. This time we're in the Bentley and Round Catalonia and this is a lap that I did um, in preparation for the race for AOR a couple of weeks ago and um, yeah, I had the Bentley feeling pretty nice man, it was such a shame that I actually ended up with damage and didn't didn't manage to stick my lap together in quality but anyway, um, the car just feel pretty good around here, the, the Bentley must have been buff around here because I remember in the past driving the Bentley around here, always used to struggle, didn't really feel that good, the balance seemed a little bit off couple that with a uh, with probably w which wasn't a great BOP but um at the moment feels really really nice around Catalonia man and I think the track temp was about 32 in this practice session but um obviously if you're running cooler cooler conditions I believe you can get this car into the 42s man but anyway without further ado here's the setup hope you guys do enjoy scripted TMG like and subscribe hit the notification bell to catch my videos first and peace So heading into the last chicane, be careful not to run too deep into that corner as it does affect your run down the back straight and through this right-hander, which sometimes, depending on the car, can actually be quite tricky to go flat if you don't get the line quite right. Anyway, heading towards turn one, obviously this section is completely flat out. Um, you want to try and break and use a lot of the AstroTurf on the outside of the track. I see a lot of people sticking towards you know the the racing line you do have to use quite a lot of astroturf break about 120 meters and these first two corners um depending on the car and the way your dampers is set up it can get a little bit unsettled as you put uh, a couple of wheels over the curb but again through turn three we still got it on slow-mo because turn three you don't want to turn in too tight too early because you will get a load of understeer which will push you towards the edge of the track the astroturf on the outside which can invalidate your lap time if you if you go too deep but we managed to navigate our way through here again we're going to use a lot of astro turf and we're going to trail break our way into the corner really just trail off the brakes slowly down to second gear and you sort of want on the exit you want to hold the car sort of in the middle of the road not too far left as you can get sort of beached on that curb a little bit which will affect your lap time and again here through this corner um i, I turned in i turned in pretty much at a normal place but i did notice when i use the porsche around here you can turn in quite a lot later to actually get the run out of the corner with the porsche but for the bentley that was a, a pretty decent corner um up and out through the fast left right and again here you sort of have to just give up the speed on the entry so you can get your foot down as fast as possible i missed the apex by a tiny bit there straighten up the car on the exit again this is a, a pretty nice corner for the bentley man you just like sort of ease off the brakes tap the brakes just before the end of the curb on the left hand side throw it in and this corner now 
it, this is always the corner I feel like if anything this is going to be the corner that messes up my lap you can get you know you can get into that breaking too late especially when you're, you're on a decent lap but we managed to hit the apex perfectly get the foot down straight away which is what you want this is how you want to take that corner like you want to sort of take a sort of a wide line in and then get on the power nice and early the Bentley's really good for this corner and with this corner here you sort of you sort of want to be able to midway through the corner put your foot down and not have the back end step out now quite a tricky quite a tricky turn here if you turn in too late you can go too deep and it affects your whole last sector so um, i could have actually taken a little bit more curb there and again make sure you get the car slowed down for this left right uh, I, I think i hit the apex way better than i did on the beginning of the lap and then after that you're straight on the power don't go too wide in the exit and that's a decent lap around Catalonia. But um, just a little things, you need to make sure you always use the, the extra bit of track that you can just to just to make sure you're opening up the corner. But hope you guys did like the track guide and here's the setup.